Hello, let's get started with metadata creation tool demon feature demonstration. For the beginning, let's create a DC profile. Um, it can be invoked by from the menu file and the uh, system offers you to field certain certain attributes of uh, application profile like for example status, description, title after it's created um, you can add to that uh, terms from the registry so for this for this purpose we used the uh, search in registry and then we selected uh, require term and uh, add that to, to our application profile. After it's added to application profile we can edit that uh, and by putting additional information into that. Additional comments and uh, specification how we are going to use that. Once the application profile is ready, we can uh, submit it to the repository, so basically publish it into the website, so that it's publicly available, and uh, as well as we can uh, save it to the RDF uh, file. Of course, we can uh, modify uh, our application profile in different ways. Uh, we can add more terms, uh, remove them, add additional information to that, change the status, obligation. Um, well, next feature is uh, creation of metadata vocabulary which is also provided by IMSA client. So for the requirement uh, parameter for each vocabulary is a uh, title but uh, system is capable to store, store more information about that like uh, status, description and others. And once we once it's created, we can add uh, metadata elements. To that, basically, the content of meta of vocabulary. As, as well as we can add a class or encoding scheme to the metadata vocabulary. We can describe it and uh, save it. As well as this information could be added, could be saved into a DF file. And submitted. Uh, also, application offer uh, interfaces in different languages, uh, like uh, German, French, for example, Dutch. Uh, for system now informs that uh, to get application fully in that selected language, it's require and restart. And once inter once it's restarted, uh, we can see that all labels are in Dutch. And uh, here we're trying. Here we're creating an application profile um, using uh, interface in Dutch, uh, as well as we can easily change the 
language to the German and uh, again to uh, to get it fully in and uh, into the language we can, we we need a restart and then once application is restarted uh, it's uh, in in German basically okay this is briefly about uh, IMSR features thank you for your attention